Welcome back to the channel, Barbarians. How you do, good sir? In today's video, we are playing a Crucible match on the max sensitivity for controller. No, I do not normally play on this, and I am turning the sprint turn scale all the way up to 0.8. Typically, I play on 0.6, and my sensitivity ranges anywhere from a 7 to a 9. The weapons I'm using for this uh, sword, just to fly around, I got the worst map possible. I'm using the Autumn Wind Pulse Rifle, which I I like, I just haven't used it enough yet. And then I'm using uh, the Trials Sidearm. So this went okay. I am a big fan of uh, movement, but uh, yeah, there were times when I was struggling to hit my shots. Alright, without any further ado, it's pretty straightforward. I just wanted to see what would happen. I do end up getting top on my team, and I believe... Yeah, I just uh, did way better than I expected. All right, let's swap, switch it over to the gameplay. All right, that's got lucky there with some teammate damage. Ooh, my shot was on point. All right, another one pushing me to the left. Wow, my shot is all over the place. Still, yep. Yep, I should have died there. Had I had some better headshots, perhaps I wouldn't have, but uh, you know, it is the way it is. Respawn all the way back here and uh, no man's land. It might be hard to tell visually as you're watching this, but uh, turning around is so fast <laughs> with 20 sensitivity. I do wish I could play on this more regularly. All right, let's go. Clearly, we have zone advantage, so they're sitting in their spawn. Oh, I had confidence there. I had some missed bursts. That guy got the W. Still top on my team. Um, yeah. This is probably my least favorite map in the game for Crucible. Figured why not. Just go all in on mobility. Switch it up to Stompies. Don't really need the sword. Now let's just see if I can hit this rocket shot. Alright, we got a guy over there. I'm getting shot at. Okay, I picked up a kill. I did not see that guy with a trace rifle camping behind a rock. Alright, I'm feeling good. Have a decent amount of kills. Considering my handicap that I'm playing with. Looks like B's a little contested. Couple uh couple targets to ADS. Ooh, ooh, the shots were clean. Looks to be maybe somebody around here. Nope, doesn't look that way. Again, we just have you know a surprising amount of pressure on their spawn point, so not really worried. Pushing up with my team, getting some team shots if I can. Yep, yep, that makes sense. Just gonna miss. Throw that, get sniped. Did hit him. And I got the cleanup. Nice. There's this guy. I don't know how this guy doesn't see me. Yep, and I barely won that. So it looks to be that we flip spawns. We've got them on lockdown, but they should be spawning A. Yep. Didn't feel comfortable in my uh, abilities there. Tried to get both. <laughs> oh wow, there's no way I should have survived that terrible play. A better place rocket there arguably would have killed them both. They were a little bit far apart though. Yeah, this one hurts. I jumped, really, really thought I could get the kill. Uh, and I just paid for it. Probably shouldn't have pushed up there. Spawning way back. It's too bad there wasn't some kind of like grab lift or something to shoot you into the middle of the map off respawn. Oh, oh, just playing safe. Just getting lane from somebody sitting still. Let's challenge it again. Yeah, what an idiot. Clearly the Mita multi-tool just putting in the work. We are over double their score. Cap C, push forward outside. Gonna rotate towards center here. 
Especially considering they have B control. I almost have my super. Perhaps. And it's not like I expected to do anything. I mean, I don't really know what I was doing here. Like, I'm completely surrounded. I'm trying to look for one person. Miss both my green. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, I got somebody. This guy to my left. Wow. Wow. I was getting excited here because I thought I had some momentum. I'm really chasing this guy. My aim's all over the place. And this guy just sprints for the heavens. Come on. Still going. Turns around, tries to kill me. Teammate picks him up. That, yeah, I'm just, that, no help there on my behalf. Yep, don't even hit him. I do see him running. I feel like for as good as the shackle grenades are, I think, honestly, people are just bad with them. All right, got that, got that clean up there. I would say me personally too, I thrive with sidearms, fusion rifles, um, some long range, typically longer range stuff. I know sidearms are short range, but stuff where you can, like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I'm going to challenge and shotgun an SMG range, but the way I use my mobility on a character is going to make the sidearm more advantageous for me. Uh, anyways, that's why I really like it. Same thing for pulses, like I'd rather use a pulse versus a scout if that makes any sense at all at the same distance um, arguably you know depending on the lane you're in scout could be the better option but if you're just this versus that I would choose pulse every time personally anyways I digress always been a pulse fan first exotic ever in destiny fun fact bad juju from I the cryptarch in destiny one oh needle storm gg yeah, they still have five supers. I almost said six. I, I can count, I promise. Uh, so it's not looking good for us. However, the scoreboard. Yeah, the sweet, sweet scoreboard. You know, I would suggest looping back on the topic of this video. You guys at least try this. Pretty fun. Um, and it, what, what does it hurt? I mean, you're just trying to play on a ridiculous sensitivity. Just definitely going with no expectations. I want a, a side note here. I don't know what it is. I haven't used it personally, but Nova Bomb, I don't know if it got buffed. It sucks you in from so far away now. It's insane. Not just from that demonstration earlier. I was, yeah, it's insane. Yeah, I got him shackled. Hit it, and it's not going to keep him there. He gets away with his uh, twirly dwirly, twirly Dan, I call him. This game's coming to a wrap. We're playing to 125. Yeah, that guy definitely should be killing me, and he does. Shotgun. Shotgun melee, baby. Opponent claimed zone a. Yep, I'm just going to cap C. I don't know why. Game's finishing out here. Um, yeah. All right, they're capping B. It doesn't, I mean... It doesn't superfluous. It doesn't really matter at this point. Yo, GG's to these guys. It was fun. I feel like some of my kills, maybe a lot of them, I caught them off guard. Uh, I'm curious though. I wish I had said this earlier in the video. Let me know what you guys play on for sensitivity. I'm very curious. Uh, one of my friends plays on three. That's super low. Like Going from this, by the way, back to what I normally play on, I felt so sluggish. It was ridiculous. But obviously on the sensitivity, I just can't consistently hit my shots. So that's straight pain. Um, I'm going to let the rest of this footage, this game play out. Pretty much the end here. Um, stay tuned for the next video. Hopefully it'll be more riveting than this, but just something I wanted to try. And uh, thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Excellent.
victory like that is why the Iron Banner exists.